The golf world has lost a giant. We've lost a buddy. Pete Dye was one of those larger-than-life characters. Pete was Pete. No airs or pretensions. He was really proud of this golf course, and he loved coming here. And we loved his visits. We're going to miss him. Pete Dye's signature is part of the landscape. His handiwork is a remarkable part of who we are. His golf course here, sketched on a napkin, has been etched into golf history. It's won too many honors and accolades to mention. It was the golf course that almost didn't happen. Well, I remember when I came up here with Mr. Ferguson, I walked this property many times, and uh, maybe five or six times from one to the other, and, and I just said, you know, it's too severe to build a golf course. And finally, he and Mr. Cook got together, and they just said, make it so you can walk it. So <laughs> it's barely walkable, but it's, it's, it's a lot different than uh, when we started out, from, that's for sure. That day we chatted in 2013, the first Legends of the LPGA tournament had just gotten underway, our first big professional tournament on the course. A man who has been called diabolical in his course designs, Pete was delighted the ladies did so well. Well, it's wonderful to see the golf tournament here and, and have the girls, because there are a lot of great players out there, and the, and the scores show it too today, so they did real well. So it's, it's great to have them here, and, it, and it'll do wonderful for the golf course and, and French Lick and everything. So I, I'm tickled to death to have it here. So are you okay with uh, somebody in at six under on your course? Oh, no question about it. I mean, if they'd have been six over, I'd have died. So there you go. <laughs> the senior PGA championship would follow. The legends would blossom into the senior LPGA championship. Pete's course has become a marquee attraction. Your, your course has uh, put us on the map, Pete. <laughs> well, I hope so, <laughs> but you never know till it's over. For Pete, it's now over, but his legacy shall long endure, and his bronze visage shall continue to watch over his magnificent creation here at French Lick Resort. <laughs>